two smart watches I have here. One is this one here. I'm just going to square away. I lost a lot of time trying to fix this here. But if you pay attention, this watch comes also with the messaging system for the Facebook, WhatsApp, and those kind of applications. And regardless of how much I try to connect one to synchronize time and settings with the Android, with the, you know, uh, I couldn't, I couldn't do it. Then I realized actually that messaging function that I stated to you right now is missing. So that thing was again, somehow modified. And the cover of the watch itself is just like the neighbor here promised me, his name is Andre Wu. He still got car parked here at the yard. The cover, this um, this plastic, whatever it is, this at the top, also is all scratched, is all fucked up. Uh, it's exactly what he said he would do. He would take this off, he would take me a new one off, and he would put me the old one. So that's a job to, I have no idea how to even synchronize watch, because I never did one. I had a smartwatch once in my life, only in Poland. Uh, and that watch had a camera like this right here at the front so that everybody could see and people would have the wrong idea that I filmed somebody or something. I didn't want that watch. I got rid of it. Um, that watch, however, worked. Everything was okay. Again, no, again, not as the same case with this here. This is a smartwatch which also has a camera, supposedly 2 megapixels. But this watch here only comes with a resolution of 240 by 240, as you see. That's all you get. That's all you get, 240 by 240. Uh, and this is advanced quality. Um, I don't even know what exactly uh, otherwise, uh, what, what exactly would that be here, but we can try. Uh, it's always 240 by 240. Uh, it can be high quality or low quality, whichever way you want to see it. But the picture that comes out of 240, as I myself have seen, uh, 240 by 240 is so shitty that you can, as well as mine, toss this uh, into a trash bin. Literally, a watch like this. It's without the camera, actually, but has a camera. That was another one. AliExpress refunded this stuff to me, the money for this watch. They accepted um, my complaint. Uh, but this really, 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 this is really, really not the fault of uh, AliExpress. And I stated this stuff because, you know, even if they, that they would want this, because they told me, the Chinese people told me, do not, do not argue with them, please do not argue, you know, just they alone, they were afraid of them. Um, I stated about synchronizing stuff because even less would I know how to install the applications here. You see, I don't have so much time to fuck around with all this stuff. I don't know how to do it. I yet have to learn how to do it and then do it. Maybe actually it's going to work. Uh, I don't know about this watch if this and how to do this kind of stuff. I have no idea. I have no idea how to do it. But seeing from what I have seen on video that a messaging option and what was described to me under the listing at AliExpress is not even present in the watch, it makes me understand that you're not going to be able to synchronize anything like this because it's just, uh, this is just the way it is. They did this here. They, 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 they did the fix here in Slovenia. They know how to fix things here. They don't know how to make them, but they know how to repair them. I should say fix them. Now, this here is the Android. Interesting part about this one here is you cannot get a bunch of applications. If you would want to synchronize the watch, you would not be capable to, to find in a Google Play applications, like really, really important applications such as um, Hren and stuff like that, which I've seen are used to synchronize watch like that, which, however, still had nothing to do with something that is actually being modified. 
if you modify the software and the watch, it will not help you no matter what kind of program you use, because I use different programs. There is no way you can connect anyhow, anyway to anything with that watch. So this was purchased new, but also ordered through the internet and delivered just like this phone and also had this kind of problem. We, I have experience in Poland alone. The system is modified, I think. Now this here, this is the shoe. Now what makes it interesting, this shoe was bought in this company here. It's a Decathlon. Decathlon, for those that are not familiarized with it, is a French company. It's a big corporation and they definitely don't make shitty stuff like this. Like, let's say that you would have like brand new shoes, like brand new. You would use them maybe like, I don't even know how many times I use them. Maybe I use this like four or five times if I did go for a walk with this stuff. And I am probably exaggerating. But it already the stuff like that you see right there that appeared here. Okay, so what is it that you see right there? Um, on one side, you see a really, really well knifed thing. Somebody really, really worked hard to peel that thing off. And then it appears like he started to peel off here too on this side. But in the middle here, in between, you don't see shit. You don't see anything. So that more likely than not, when you pay attention to that, this stuff is knifed. Now other shoes, sure, during my absence, was not as lucky. That one, it seems like, I think, Andre Uhl. It's either uh, he or Adana Kulens, the guy across the street. Right, right across the street. Either he or this individual here, Andre Uhl. Uh, this one, however, not so lucky at all. And wow, look, interesting, eh? Because... It's not like in this case here that we would have this here, but it looks like that knife also somehow wandered on the side. You see, it's not even even. Uh, this thing is also knifed here. If you would look, it goes toward this direction. It doesn't even go toward that direction. So I would have like a really, really weird feet or something like this that would do stuff like that. These shoes are knifed because they looked like this. That's why they are knifed. These shoes here, however, are just as old as those other, not as old, these are newer shoes. But those shoes, they never ever were used and are just as new as these shoes here. These are also new shoes, two I bought. However, one I had only for the city uh, and the other I had uh, also, I went to walk into the nature. Now, the thing about it is that the shoes, if you look, they are dirty. They are still dirty. But there is nowhere anything that would be like... Wow, that's funny because I still have 5 gigabytes free memory and it would just stop filming. Um, but in Poland, we have seen how that worked out. You can see here, look, not a trace, something that you would, that you would like stuck in a, in something and, you know, that you would brush against something. Nothing, look, like brand new shoes, except that they are dirty. They are dirty, that's all there is to it. And so the person got an idea that this is part two, yes, that's how it works here. Uh, person got idea that because they were dirty like this, it was just time to knife them, basically. So those would not look like this. So that's basically what that is. I don't think the Decathlon is doing shoes like this. These shoes are really, really, actually, this stuff is really, really solid. So yeah, they do not fall apart so quickly these shoes they don't go apart so quickly uh, i did brought them upstairs my mom took them downstairs i know they are dirty but the thing about it is that how can i say 
brand new, you know, this brand new is like brand new, you know, brand new shoes, you know, brand new shoes, but all fucked up. There are two other pairs when I came that, but those are the shoes like this, that, well, on the side, knife too. Um, it's like going basically and throwing money away um having a locks that everybody has them and does shit as please when you are absent uh, that's too damn bad because i don't think that my parents did that kind of stuff um or that some relative would come here and do the stuff like that i don't think so now it's kind of funny i know that i have to report the stuff like this that this is the stuff i have to talk about it's pathetic but all right if this kind of updates are necessary we'll continue to make them that's okay uh why not some people find purpose in doing stuff like this to the people others uh find purpose in building cars rockets and stuff like this but what the f would the world do without good and evil let's put it this way what the fuck world would do well the answer is world is doing nothing at this point 